I don't know, it's not as bad as how I thought it was going to be. Like, it's not that bad. I would personally wear it with the strings down like this, rather than like tying it into a bow or anything. But I really like it. I really like this top. I know I keep saying it's quite nice, I know you like it, but I actually do really like it. And she bought it on purpose because she knew I was going to hate it. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. Thank you for clicking and joining me today. As you can see by the title, today we're doing part two of my mom doing my sheet in order. If you haven't watched part one of my mom doing my sheet in order, I'll leave it linked in the description bar below so you can check that out too. Before we get started into today's video, please make sure to like, comment and subscribe and also turn notifications on so you don't miss my next upload. Also, all the items I try on will be linked below in the description box. So like in part one, my mom will bring the item in, I'll give it a quick first impression and then I'll try it on, I'll give it a rating and then my mom will give it a rating also. I am excited to see what the rest of the clothes look like because in part one, she didn't do too bad. She did get a few things that were a bit mm, not really my style but apart from that, she did actually do quite well. So I'm excited to see what else she's picked out. So let's get started with the first item. Okay, so it's just a waffle knit jumper sort of dress and it's hooded as well. So I like the colour of this one. So let's try this one on and see how it fits. So this is what the jumper dress looks like on and I actually really like it. Again, it's not like a thick fabric, but it's like really soft and really comfortable. I would say, however, it's not like that long to wear like a jumper dress by itself. So if I was gonna wear it out, I'd have to like sew some cycling shorts underneath it. If I lift my arms up, like you'd see everything, but it is quite nice. I think I could like wear it to like lounge around the house in and like do like chores and stuff. But if I was wearing it out, it would look nice like a pair of cycling shorts. So let's see what my mom thinks about it. What do you think? Okay, it's nice because oversized. Mm -hmm. Oversized. It's an oversized jumper. Oversized. Oversized. <laughs> it's a bit short. <laughs> Let's supposed to wear with the leggings or jeans. Yeah, if I was saying, I could probably put some cycling shorts yeah. if I was going out. But if I was in the house, I could just wear it like Wait, this. No. Yeah, if I had shorts underneath it in the house, yeah. I could wear it like this. What would you rate this one? I'd rate that one a six. Hmm? Six. A six? Yeah. I think I'd probably rate it the same. Because it is a little bit short to wear like a jumper dress by itself. But I do still like it and the fabric's quite nice and I love the colour of it as well. So I think I'd probably rate it a six as well. Where is it? Stop it! <laughs> okay. Okay, apparently it's meant to be off the shoulder and it's, it's like a velvety kind of touch to it. Then it has buttons on both of the sleeves. I'm not too sure about this one, but we'll see what it looks like on. I'm not gonna lie, when I first saw this top, I didn't like it at all. But now, I'm not too sure. I think it's actually quite nice. I don't know. So again, it does have like these buttons down the arms on both sleeves. And then it's kind of like a bolt neck. But then I'm thinking if you wear it like, like this, I don't know, is it just me? But it doesn't look as bad as how I thought it was gonna look. I don't know if I'd wear it with like a smooth tuck in or like a little bit bagged out. I don't know, it's not as bad as how I thought it was gonna be. Like, it's not that bad. I don't know what I'd call this material, but it's so nice and so soft. It's almost like a suede velvet sort of feel, but I actually think it's not that bad. Like, it's really not that bad. I thought it was gonna look worse. And I really like the off the shoulder sort of detail like this. So let's see what my mom would rate it. Ooh, good song. Do you like it? Yeah, I like it, it's nice. I thought it was going to look worse on. <laughs> Trust me. <laughs> but yeah, it actually looks quite nice. It's quite nice. Yeah, because yeah. I think you're meant to wear it like yeah. this. Mm -hmm. But I don't really like it like that. I prefer it, it like, nice. yeah. So it's not that bad, isn't it? It's quite nice. Yeah, I wrote that one a 10. A 10? Yeah. Why does this one get a 10? Because I like it more. <laughs> really? Yeah. It's sort of with that bottom. Yeah, it looks quite nice. Mm -hmm. I'd say it looks quite grown up, don't you think? Yeah. In like a sophisticated way, looks really nice. I'm going out for a meal. Yeah, when we're allowed back outside. <laughs> <laughs> but mom would rate this one a ten. I don't think I'd go for a ten, but it's definitely. <laughs> <laughs> 
I don't think I'd give it a 10, but it's probably worth about an eight because it is quite nice and I love how soft it is. It's quite nice. I like it. Let's get on to the next item. Okay, this one's nice. So this one is like a cream colored crop top and it has drawstrings on either side. So you can adjust it to make it shorter and then you can tie it off. I like this one. It's like a nice neutral color as well. So we try this one on and see how it fits. So this is what the white top looks like and I actually really like it. I would personally wear it with the strings down like this rather than like tying it into a bow or anything. But I really like it. I love how neutral and basic like white and creams are. But the only issue is how dirty they get. So I've literally just tried this on and it has makeup literally all over it. And it is a little bit on the thin side. But apart from that, I really like it. And then you can adjust the side so you can have it a little bit longer like that if you wanted to but if you wanted to as well if you just pull it up it adjusts into like a crop top so i really like that the versatility of it as well so let's see what my mom would rate it you like this one yeah it's quite nice isn't it it's quite nice and then you can adjust it. it yeah and pull it up or down okay so you can tie the strings as well yeah i wouldn't personally tie the strings i'd leave the strings like that i like how it looks like that you know what i mean like that you don't like it down Looks okay, yeah, but why dress up and leave it down? I like it, so you would rather... I don't even know how to tie bows anymore. So you would rather like tie it up like that? Yeah. Okay, I guess it doesn't look too bad like that. Mm -hmm. Let's tie the other one. And it does keep it in place when you tie it as well. Yeah. Okay, it doesn't look too bad. I thought I wasn't going to like it at least if it was tied up. But it doesn't look too bad. What would you rate it? Six and a half. Six and a half? Mm-hmm. I'll probably rate it a six only because again it's a little bit see-through and because it's cream it does get a lot of makeup on it but yeah let's move on to the next item Rockle's back to say hi <laughs> say hi Rocco. <laughs> look his face needs to be brushed <laughs> say hi Rocco. Rocco, say hi is he staring at the camera <laughs> let's go It feels a bit heavy. Oh, this one's like a nice casual jumper dress again. So again, it does have like the hoodie on the back. And yeah, it's just a grey ribbed fabric. It's not as thick as like a normal jumper, but it does feel quite nice. So I'll try this one on and see how I like it. So now I have on the grey jumper dress and this is what it looks like. Again, it is in a ribbed material and it's on the thinner side, so it's not too thick. It is really nice and soft and really comfortable, but I don't think I would wear this out. It's just like, it looks a little bit more pajamery. So I think I'll just wear this as like a nice loungewear inside, but I wouldn't wear it outside. Hmm. I mean, a bit tighter, it's a bit loose. Yeah. It looks more like something you wear, wear inside. Yeah, that's why I said it's like a loungewear thing. Yeah, because I thought it would have been tighter, maybe a smaller size. Yeah, because it's in a size medium, isn't it? But no, it reminds me of. What? Remember the pyjama that I had when I was a kid, the Carly Rae Mark? Yeah. <laughs> yes, it reminds me of that. And it has a hood as well. So when I was younger, I had a white pyjama dress, like the Carly Minogue dress. This and same year, like, sun came out, you had the same night. Yeah, <laughs> so it reminds me of that. But I think it would look really nice to like wear in the house. Yeah. Like doing errands and just chilling, but I wouldn't really wear it out. So what would you rate it, Mom? Um, maybe a four. Yeah, that's about It's nice, nice but... Um, a four because I can't wear it out. Yeah, I would say about four or three. Because it's nice and comfortable, but I just wouldn't wear it outside. It would just be like an indoor sort of outfit. So let's move on to the next item. Yeah. Oh, okay. That makes sense. It's like a grey wrapped top. Yeah. So oh, it has a lot of string to it. So I'm guessing it wraps around like a couple times. But it does look a little bit big because it's in a size medium. It does look a little bit big, but I'm guessing it should be okay because once you wrap it, it should cover like the bust and everything fine. But yeah, let's try this one on and see how it fits. I really like this top. So I was thinking it was going to be like a little bit big, but because it is like a wrap it yourself sort of top, so you can adjust like how, how much coverage you get. So I really like this one. There was a lot to wrap. So I think I've wrapped it around like three times and I've just like bowled it off at the back 
but I actually really like this one. I'll say this one is definitely a bit of me. Like, literally, I love this one. So let's see what my mom thinks of it. Mm, I like that one. It's quite nice, isn't it? Yeah. It has a pin. You can tie it to the front, to the side. Yeah, you can like customize how much, how you want to wrap it because there's literally so much string. But I've just wrapped it to the back like this. Yeah. It looks quite nice. to the side as well. Yeah. Yes, because it is still quite a lot to like wrap. So you can yeah. just like wrap it like this. Mm -hmm. Is that how it was on the model to the yeah. side? Mm -hmm. Like not what I'm doing. <laughs> so, yeah. yeah, that's quite cute. It looks like a little ballerina top. It's quite nice. So you can wrap it literally however you want to wrap it. So what would you rate this one? Seven. A seven? Yeah. Yeah, I'll probably give it a seven or eight. I really like this one. And it's nice and comfortable. So let's go on to the next item. Oh, this is nice. It's like a milkmaid style top. This is quite nice. And again, it's like in a knitted jumper sort of fabric. This is quite nice. And it has like a little keyhole detail in the middle as well. So I'm excited to try this one on. It looks quite nice. So this is a milkmaid top and it's quite nice. I know I keep saying it's quite nice and I really like it, but I actually do really like it. The only thing I'd say is if I was getting it for myself, I'd probably get it in a size small, only because it is in that stretchy knit material. So I could have gotten away with it in a size small just to make it fit a little bit better. But apart from that, I really do like it. And it's quite, it's quite different because I wouldn't have like picked this out for myself, but I do like it. So let's see what my mom thinks about it. What do you reckon? Ooh, it's a bit wide on the neck. Yeah, that's what I said. It's a little bit big. I've yeah. probably gotten away with it in a size small. If it was small. a smaller, yeah. it much better. But apart from that, but it's, it's it's nice. Yeah. It's just that it's too wide on your neck. Yeah. yeah. But it would have fit nice if it was a smaller one. So I'd rate that one maybe a four. Yeah, probably give it a five. Mm, that's a four. But it is quite nice. I like the shape of it. It's quite different because I wouldn't have picked this up for myself. But I do like it. So let's move on to the next item. If you can hear any like scuffling in the background, it's just my dog. He keeps running in and out of the room because the door's open. Oh, this is really nice. It has a white ribbed midi dress. So the ribbing on this one is quite chunky compared to a lot of other like ribbed dresses. So I do quite like this one. So let's see how I like the fit of it on. So this is the white midi dress. I actually do like it. The only thing I'd say is that it's a little bit thin with the material and this part comes quite high up. So I feel like I'm having to keep my neck up like that to try and stop the makeup from like rubbing onto this part. But apart from those two issues, it is quite a nice dress. Like, I don't think I could get past how thin it is, but let's see what my mom thinks. What do you reckon? That looks nice. It's nice, isn't it? Yeah. The only thing is, the material is a bit thin, so it's a little bit see-through. That's exactly what I was going to say, but you can wear black knickers yeah. and black bra. Because at the moment, I just have nude, a nude bra and nude underwear, so, so I can you see can a wear black. black. Yeah. Yes, probably if I had black underwear on, you wouldn't be able to see that much. But I do like it. So it is quite similar to the dress I've tried in part one. So if you haven't seen part one, again, I'll leave it linked down below in the description so you can check that out. But I do like it. It's just that this part's a little bit high and then it's a little bit um, thin. So what would you rate it? Six. Six? Yeah. I think I'll probably give it a five. Mm -hmm. Just because of how see-through it is and how thin it is. So let's see the next item. Okay, have a look. Okay, so this is in the same kind of colorway as the Milkmaid style top. It does look quite nice though. It's like a mock neck knitted jumper. Again, it isn't in like a thick material. It's quite thin, so it's like a t-shirt sort of material, but it does look quite nice. So I'll try it on and see how I like it on. So this is what it looks like on. If I was shopping for myself, I probably wouldn't have picked it up because of the colorway, because I like my usual color scheme but it's not that bad the only thing i'd say about the top itself is that the fit is kind of awkward so it's really tight underneath here but then the shoulder part at the top is quite big but apart from that it does fit really nicely and because it is so like snug and tight it does kind of look like a bodysuit and i'll actually wear it tucked in so it's kind of good that it's really tight and it will stay inside my jeans so let's see what my mom would rate it what would you rate it i rate it's one six six yeah that's what i was gonna give it Okay, it's quite nice. I probably wouldn't have picked it out myself, but it's quite nice. So both my mum and I would give this one a six. So let's move on to the next item. <laughs> I 
<laughs> I feel like she always saves the worst for last. <laughs> okay, so this one's like a crushed velvet sort of crop top. And it's got like a peplum at the bottom. I don't think you can adjust the thing in the middle. Okay, so the thing in the middle is not adjustable, the ruching, but you can tie it off. I don't know how this is gonna look like on, but, and it has like flared sleeves, but it's cropped. I don't know about this one, but let's see what it looks like on. It could be like the dress and it could surprise me and look better on. So we'll try it on and we'll see how it looks. Okay, I really don't like this one. So I thought it was gonna be like a situation like the dress from part one where it looked horrible on the hanger. But when I tried it on, it was quite nice. But this one is just a no. I hate the fabric. I hate the way it looks. And I can see over there with the lights on it, it looks even worse. It's like proper like reflective and shiny. I don't like this one at all. The shape of it is just not me at all. The fabric is not me. Or maybe it's just the colour, but I don't like it at all. It's kind of weird as well. So if I move my arms, it moves all the hemlines and then it <laughs> looks like this. So I, I don't like this one. <laughs> Let's see what my mom thinks about it. Hmm. I think I like it. Do you like it? I like it. I know it's not your style, but kind of look nice. To so go with. Do the plugs when it's open? What? No. <laughs> but I don't wear this in the club. You know what? I know it's not your style, but you know things that are not your style, you can still try it and see all the fix. Because I knew it wouldn't be your style because I never bought you anything like that before. But I said, let me buy it and see what it would look on you. Uh -huh. That's why I bought it. Because I would never buy something like that for you. <laughs> Even Rocco said, Do you like it, Rocco? Take it off. Do you like it, <laughs> <laughs> no! So I would rate that one maybe a three. Because yeah. I know it's not your style, that's why I said let's get it and see Come how on. it looks. Now that you're wearing it, mm -hmm. <laughs> it's not what I thought it would have been. It's not that nice, is it? Because I know it's not your style, but I went and got it anyway. Because I wanted you to try it just like for just for the a laugh. That's what I got it anyway. <laughs> I like the sleeves because I do like flare sleeves. I do have a lot of tops and jumpers that have like this flare flute sleeve but I just don't like the shape of it, the material of it, or the colour of it's not bad, it's just the shape and the material of it. So I would probably give this one a minus 10. <laughs> you look like a curtain. <laughs> a curtain, a curtain. It's curtain. too much, I don't like yeah. it. Realistically, I'd probably give it a zero out of 10. I don't like this one and my mum doesn't like it that much either. And she bought it on purpose because she knew I was gonna hate it. So guys, that's all we have time for today. Thank you so much for watching and joining me today. Thank you so much for watching part one and part two of my mom doing my sheen haul. Again, if you haven't seen part one, I'll leave it linked in the description box below so you can check that out. All the items I tried on again will also be in the description box. So thank you for watching. Please make sure to like, comment and subscribe before you leave and also turn the notifications on so that you don't miss the next upload. Thank you for watching guys. Bye.